Hello guys, this is Ajay. Today's video is about how to install libraries required for Shunya users. Okay, so you will you will find this uh, doc in the Google Drive link that we have provided to you. Okay, so basically you need to follow these steps, and I, I will also show these steps in this video. So these are the commands that you have to that you need to download that you need to use for downloading the required libraries. So first of all, I need to open a terminal. So first of all, just go to desktop. Let me close this. And now click type here to search. You have a type here to search option. And now type cmd. So you will get command prompt. Click on it. Those who are using Mac, you can use bash, that is your uh, default terminal, okay. And one more thing, those who are using Mac, you need to use pip3 instead of pip. Let me, let me explain. So, this is the command that will be for Windows users. So, if you are using Mac, you need to use this type of command, which means at every point, Whenever I am using pip, you need to use pip3. So, your command is pip3 install whl, which means here also, everywhere you need to use pip3, 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 okay? So, I hope you understand. Yeah. First of all, I need to download pip install whl. So, I am going to execute that command. Okay, let me do one thing. Let me keep in this way. Yeah, it will be clear for you. Okay. First of all, pip install whl. Okay. Hit enter. So basically, it is showing requirements already satisfied. Because I have already I have already pip whl has been installed in my laptop. So in my in your case, you might have already this. If you have this uh, if you have this uh, extension already this library so you will get you also get requirements already satisfied otherwise you will get this type of message so you will get this type of successful installed so you will get this type of message successful installed okay whenever you get successful installed or requirements already satisfied which means it is running fine okay i hope you understand so first of first command is completed pip install whl now pip install flask pip install flask okay pip install flask and then pip install requests and then pip install excel wings pip install excel wings And now pip install pyyaml. Okay. Pip install pyyaml. Enter. So, in all these cases, I am getting requirements already satisfied because I have already installed all these libraries. So, that's why. In your case, you will get successfully installed. And you will get some this type, this type of icons like the download get it get started so this type of okay after pip install pyyml now pip install pyotp pip install pyotp that that was completed and now pip install web socket Client web socket client and then pip install pandas pip install pandas okay so after completing all these things 
so you have some tricky part here so after that you need to open this link so this is the basic so this link is basically the google drive link that you have provided to you so once you simply copy this and paste it in the in your browser so 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 you already have this google drive link so it will take you to this page and just double click shunya so right now you are shunya is double click shunya and here you will have noren rest api file noren rest api file okay click on it click on three dots and download so the download has been completed now click on it and show in folder so basically you need to go to the go to the downloads folder okay okay make sure there is nothing in between any dot whl okay sometimes you might have you might get you might get in the this type of uh, some some of you might get sometimes you might get one or two in between any and whl okay sometimes you might have you might get any and whl so in this case you need to rename it and you need to remove that one okay so at the end at the end you need to have any dot whl in between any and whl you you only have to have dot that's it okay after that so those who are using windows so you can simply click click on the address bar click on the top address bar and then type cmd enter so this will take you to the new command prompt new command prompt okay okay so and this will take you to the new command prompt this is for windows those who are using mac so i am telling to those who are using mac so you can simply on this folder so on the folder where the file was previously there you simply right click on the folder and click show more options and then open folder as intellij idea open folder as intellij idea because this you you already have this thing right okay simply click uh, trust projects check check this box and click trust project okay after coming to here simply click terminal at the bottom you will have terminal in the bottom you will have okay you can simply close it at the bottom you will have terminal option terminal okay click on it and so right now whatever whatever the commands i am showing to you you can execute those commands here okay here below so right now i i am showing to windows users like so i already said you those who are using windows you will get this type of command prompt so and those who are using mac you can simply follow this process and you can execute those commands here whatever the commands i am executing there okay i hope you understand so right now so the command that you have to need you need to use is pip install pip install and come to this downloads folder and just right click on it and rename it and just copy the whole text copy the whole text highlight that and right click copy and then come to the command prompt and now just right click just keep your mouse here and right click it will get pasted okay it will get pasted and now hit enter that's it here also i am getting already installed because i have already installed this noren rest api okay guys this is the end of this uh, shunya users so that's it and then you need to install this pip install okay guys thank you